Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And oh my God, you would think this season is over. And I guess it's not because somebody is obviously, it seems, trying to milk it for everything it's got. So we'll talk about this. But before we do, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button, turn on your notifications. If you like the video, smash the like button and also drop a comment down in the comment section below. So this happened within the past, I would say maybe 24 hours where Jessica decides to speak out in on uh, pretty much, I guess, some things that Alexia said about her and Eric. Um, the thing is, I mean, she really put it out there. She was stop playing with me you a habitual liar um she got blocked by the executive producers of a different show how she got these fans out here fool trying to get support for as she called it a fake movement um and a lot of this has something to do with i guess alexia i don't know if this was in an interview or whatever Speaking on Jessica and Eric being already engaged before coming on the show. And so with Jessica, she kind of explained that in this post. And you can pause it and read it all the way through. I will say there is a expletive language warning. I mean, I know we all grown folks here, but I do like to put that out there. Um, and then her saying, you know, you talking about my relationship and me and uh, Eric and I already being engaged. You got a fake fourteen year old, a uh, for, fake fourteen year relationship, and I mean, we all heard the, you know, the interview that Darion did with um, Little Black Book ninety one, and how he just dropped a T on the fact that their relationship never existed, um, and that you know they did it all for the show and for fame and had a plan and you know all of this stuff, and so. The crazy thing is, you know, with all of this and her saying these things about Jessica, just like, okay, you won't talk about me. Okay, let's talk about you. And that's how all this stuff really just blew up um, within the past 24 hours. She was even saying that the girl even had a whole nother dude while trying to plan this whole um, situation with Darion and deal with the show that they were on. And then she was saying, I guess she had, you know, made some folks mad, you know, that some folks wanted to come for her. I mean, it was crazy. And I mean, it's unfortunate that this is where we are, you know, um, and everything. And she even said that Alexia told her out of her own mouth that the relationship was you know, that her and Darion was not together and that you were helping him with his music. So she put it all out there, you know, and sometimes, you know, I mean, I guess she thought she won this one, but in the, you know, in the interim, it ended up exploding. I mean, Alexia has been saying on the views, I'm good, I'm good, but I guess in the background is just imploding. I don't know. I'm just speaking on what I see. I'm not there. But I like to share these things with you guys, you know, to keep you guys up to date on everything, no matter what show. Um, I find it interesting with OWN Network that both Ready to Love and Put a Ring on it, you know, they just let their cast members speak freely. You know, other shows like, um, you know, of course, Married at First Sight and, you know, uh, Love Island, Temptation Island, they usually don't let them do all that talking unless it's way after the show. And I think even there's still limits on what they can say after the show. I know Married at First Sight put folks on lockdown. But um, it's just interesting. Now, I will I say it's kind of 50-50 for me because, yeah, they're doing a lot of talking. But at the same time, I like the transparency. Because it, it definitely gives you, you know, the shed a light on the shows that, you know, Sometimes this stuff is not real. It's just for entertainment purposes only. And I try to keep it in that perspective. That's why I'm, a, I'm very objective on this channel about how I speak about the cast members. But in this case, with Alexia, you know, I mean, folks were, she had a whole group of women rallying behind her because, I mean, it sounded bad. 14-year relationship. 
the guy she with cheated with another young woman while on the show. And then the three babies that were born supposedly while they were together. You know, I mean, a lot of people were feeling for Alexi. And to find out it was only a plot, you know, it's got some folks just, you know, disappointed. And now that it's out, you know, for her to poke the bear at another cast member, of course, now that other cast member is like, okay, you know what? Since y'all think Darian is lying, okay, let me spill my tea. And pretty much it support what Darian was saying. So sound off in the comments. Let me know what you guys think about all this. Um, Hey, I thought the season was over and everybody went to their corners, but I guess not. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one.